it's just hard and I'm dealing with it every day that's possible for me to deal with. It's just really hard and tough. Ashley Moffitt is a mother in New Orleans. She says her 12 year old daughter, Arabian Gales, was shot in September of 2013. We was inside sleep when uh, the bullet came through the glass and hit in the head. Her daughter died at the hospital. It's hard and I deal with it every day. They have to go to a graveyard and see her and sit down and talk to her at a graveyard. She says her daughter's killer was convicted, but many of her friends and family members who have lost a loved one to violence in the city didn't get justice. Uh, yeah, they need more police uh, detectives. Al Mims Jr. lost his father. He was shot and killed 30 years ago. He says no one has been convicted. He's pushing on the community to help the homicide detectives. Those two murders that were on uh, uh, Josephine and, and, uh, and uh, Jackson Avenue, People know who killed those people. That, that's ridiculous that nothing has come forward. That was execution. New Orleans Police Chief Michael Harrison. What we want to do is we, we know we're short. We're short because, number one, uh, we're a growing department. I've promoted a number of people from homicide. We're now in different supervisory positions. Some have left and retired to go on to retirement. Some have left to go do other, other things. And being short on homicide detectives, he says, can hinder investigations. It takes longer to investigate, um, and you can't give as much time to any one case that you would like to give or that it really deserves. Um, but that's just where we are right now. We lost a number of officers over the years. They need more. They really do need more homicide detectives. I just tell her I love her, never gave up on her. I miss her every day, every day I miss her. I just wish she was here right now with me, out here playing.